house by Sun Type Jimmy and it's day two here in Dubai and it's breakfast. So as my breakfast oh sort of here's my bread and here you've got some omelette, French toast, hash brown, sausage, omelette and whatever that stuff is and jam. So that's pretty much my breakfast. Nice. Uh, I just finished my breakfast. I was just heading back to my room to just chill for a bit before going out again. So yeah, today I'm gonna be going to the tower and a bunch of other stuff. I don't know, we're still trying to sort things out. So I don't know for definite, but there's this bus tour, but that is still working things out. But yeah. Uh, we're also going to eat out for lunch, so I'm going to record some of that. But literally, that was the best breakfast ever. Love the hash browns, they were so nice, and it was my first time having them. They're not like, so freaking nice. bigger or smaller than Westfield but you know we'll see and yeah so that's my answer we even got pillars as well what the hell is this it really does creep me out in a way kind of reminds me of a thing from fairy tale or a nightmare tiger okay i definitely don't like the way he's looking at people so now we got some vouchers for the big tower thingy and now looking for the place to exchange them ooh light up trees Look how cool this is. Look how cool this is. I love lights and they, they did it really neat. See we got a few more shops. It does sort of look more bigger than Westfield Chapel. Maybe I buy it a lot. So there, so you got some fish. Nice. 
and so here we've got Dubai Aquarium which we're not gonna go on but still loads of fishy 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 and here is the replica of a true size of a king croc a how size of a king croc look at that Lights, sexy lights. And then you got some jewelry there. I think I've had enough of jewelry for a while. Even though I'm not buying any, it still feels creepy as hell. Here's what the tower looks like, and you got someone in it. Literally to get all your information and it looks like something <laughs> My childhood dream of becoming a superhero is done. Just this is what all I needed to see. This was all I needed. <laughs> to them because a lot of them are out but this part you can't see all the way to the top because it's literally so bright And it's a bit more cooler. You can still see the great view.
Shocket, 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 shocket. Ooh, so this is what it looks like on the outside. Okay. I think I'm saying that right, I'm not sure. Probably saying that wrong. And here we've got some more to show you. Magnets, 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 magnets. So we've got some cups, got some key rings, I'm assuming. Some frames, don't know why. And then we've also got some clothing and stuff. Just finished going through the whole thing. And I'm just glad to be back on the ground because I'm scared of heights and my legs were shaking the entire time but I really did enjoy it so definitely I don't think I want to go on it again but literally I'm scared of heights and my legs were shaking the entire time so I was afraid to look down other people who were responsible for the creation of Burj Khalifa looks like look at all these nice little people the people that go unnoticed and stuff. Got something. Da -da 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 -da. Individuals from every corner of the globe come together for Bush Khalifa, combining their talent, expertise, and hard work to make their dream a reality. From design to construction to operation, each of these pe people played an important role in the project. Meet some of the people behind Bush Khalifa. Looks like these people are them. We got some people's names up there, some down here. It looks here it shows the development of the construction. So we got stuff there. This is how it looked before. And that they just added some more stuff to it. And this is actually on this you got two of us there. Uh, there. We got the tower. <laughs> and it's still growing, it's still not finished. An upgraded version. I mean, look at that. Look at that. Look at it all. It's the final product. Look how sick it looks, how tall it looks, and that's what I'm in right now. Put on the ground. What the hell is this? I don't know whether I should like it or be terrified. Looks like Mr. Potato, the face. Panda. Panda. Still not sure whether I should be, be going all cute or I should be terrified. Back in the mall right now, don't know what we're going to be doing. But yeah. Now I've just seen something that like some of you guys may remember from childhood, like I definitely remember this. Who remembers this guy from the book? The Gruffalo. I remember this. They even built this whole little play thing. Ah, memories. So beautiful. Child. Cool, they got a hummingbird bakery here. That bakery is so freaking sexy. Look at this. It is sick. I don't know why they're making men on it, but okay, whatever floats these people float. Still so sick. And that was here, and apparently there's another one over there. These people must be really into making men doing stuff like this. Definitely. How crazy is that? We've got another one right there. Look at this. Didn't see it from this earlier on. Oh, there's a shop. Zoom in. That's the 
ชอบเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยงวดเลยฮะเลสาวงวดเลสาวงวดเลสาวนี่หรอโลจันโลจันโลจันโลจันโลจันโลจันโลชื่อมันอีกทีแต่เฮ้ยแล้วพวกนี้สเปกเกอร์สที่ว่ากลาดิเอเตอร์ฉันคิดว่าจากเกรซเป็นอิมเมจิกแล้วคุณก็มีสัตว์ชีวิตเล็กๆมาที่ก็ไปสู่นิกเกอร์ไม่รู้จักนายมาตัวนั้นไหมไปในชาริเอ๋ยที่ห้องเสียงคุณก็ไปที่นั่นแล้วคุณก็มีสัตว์อยู่เราอยู่ในร้านขายของแล้วฉันกำลังดูสัตว์แต่นี่แค่ทำให้ฉันมีความสนใจแล้วคุณก็มีที่อับราฮัมลิงค์ I think I got a little horse guy. I think that's who he is. I don't know. Yep, Abraham Lincoln says down there. And then here you've got horses. Several horses of different size. You got elephants. Here you've got I think a peacock. Weird, weird, and two peacocks kissing. So the first thing is when you come in the door, it looks like this. So I got all my stuff pretty much all over. Then here we got the bathroom, which is quite nice. You got a sink, toilet, and stuff. Bomb washer. You got your nice little bath here. Shower head up there. You got you got a mirror, thingy. Here you got the hair dryer, sexy mirror to. You know, check yourself out in the morning. Then we go this way, and this is what it looks like. So you got the two beds here. So I'm sleeping on one. My dad's sleeping on one. Over here we've got a gun on the wall. Don't know if it's real or not. Still pretty sick. Probably said the same. You got a TV here. I haven't watched any of the TV. Then if we go here, there's kind of like a cupboard where you can put stuff in, which we've put a few things in. Here is just the fridge. So I just put just some sweets, bottles of water and stuff. Hey, you can just sit around and stuff. You got a nice little table here. Then you got a chair which you can just sit there. And they always give the tea bag, so they just give them tea bags and stuff. And milk. Well, they just gave powdered milk. So yeah. And out here, if we look out. This is what the outside looks like. And yeah. I guess that's about it. And tomorrow is the last full day, so the day after tomorrow, I'll be go. We'll be leaving Dubai to go to uh, to go to Dhaka, where we're gonna be staying. I think like one night, a hotel. Get picked up by one of my relatives, and then six-hour drive. Then we're gonna be staying in, going to Bangladesh, Chittagong, for a bit. But yeah, that's pretty much the plan. Uh, tomorrow, after the boat tour, we don't know what we, what else we're gonna do. Maybe that the rest of the day is, is gonna be a relaxed session. Not sure, but that's pretty much all we've got planned. Hey guys, so now it's time for dinner, and so I'm now going to try Chinese. Yesterday was intercontinental, so hopefully Chinese is good because I love Chinese food. So yeah. So 
that was just my dinner you saw I didn't record too much the highlights for today was definitely going to that big tower Bush Khalifa I think I'm saying it right anyway it was fun really hot today and yeah I guess that's pretty much it um tried Chinese for dinner and it was amazing because I love Chinese and now it's time to get ready and go to bed and just to finish the ed some editing before I go to bed don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave all your comments down in the comment section below and don't forget to share this video with all your friends so that they can join in the fun that's it from me, say peace